I am currently working on a Unity game that is inspired by the classic mobile game, Feedback. While the game is still in prototype stage, I am excited to share my progress and insights so far. The initial concept for the game was to create a beat'em up game with modern gameplay mechanics and features, inspired by classic games like Streets of Rage and Feedback. I created a list of features that I wanted to include in the game such as robust combat system, varied enemy types, and engaging boss battles. I wanted the game to be accessible to casual gamers but also provide depth and challenge for experienced players. It's worth mentioning that I am not trying to copy feedback or create any kind of spiritual successor. The development process started with building the core mechanics of the game such as players movement, attacks, special abilities. To accomplish this, I added attack, jump and crouch functionality to the player script. I focused on creating a smooth and responsive combat system that allows players to feel like they are in control of their character. While creating input for PC is relatively easy, creating swipe based input for mobile devices has been quite frustrating. I am using swipe gestures for action like kicking, jumping and dodging, and taps for punching. If the player touches the screen, I store the position of the touch as the starting position of the swipe. If player moved their finger, I calculated the distance of the swipe. To detect if the swipe was in certain direction, I checked the angle of the swipe, then triggered different actions based on the angle. The attack system is designed to be combo based, allowing players to chain together multiple attacks for maximum damage. The jump system allows the player to avoid enemy attacks, while the crouch system allows player to dodge incoming attacks. Once the basic mechanics were in place, I began working on games AI and enemy behaviors. I wanted each enemy type to have its own unique attack patterns and weaknesses which required a lot of testing and tweaking to get right. Level design was also a major focus during development. For the prototype, I created a single level that takes place in a city street, where player can fight against a variety of enemies. As development progressed, I continued to fine tune the game's mechanics, enemy behaviors and level design. Since the prototype only has one level, I am currently in the process of testing and balancing the game, making sure that it provides a challenging but fair experience for the players. I am also working on adding more options and settings to give players more control over their gameplay experience. While the game is still in prototype stage, I am excited to see how it will turn out. Creating a game inspired by feedback has been a challenging but rewarding experience and I am confident that players will enjoy the final product. I will continue to work hard to ensure that the game is polished, engaging and fun to play. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe.